Hi and welcome back to Connect TV. Thanks for tuning in. This is Hayden. So in this quick demonstration video, I'm going to show you how to look up a column from another table using Power Query. Now, we can do that fairly straightforward in DAX, but Power Query can sometimes be a little bit more complex. You can merge tables, but sometimes you just need to look up another value. So give you a quick look at the data. I have a list of products here. So I've got my product ID, name and price, and I've got my orders. So I just want to add the product price into this table so I can start to calculate the quantity versus price. So to do that, rather than merge tables and, and, and add more complexity in there, I'll show you a quick way that we can do this through um, using the M code. So selected a custom column, I'm going to call this product price. Right, to get started here, first of all, open brackets, we've got to build up another sort of let statement um, that's, that's within all M code. So I'm going to start off with let. And what I need to do here is define almost a variable of what I want to look up. So I want to look up a product ID. So I'm going to call this product can spell it right, product ID. Still can't spell it right. There we go. Eventually got there. Now I'm going to tell it what I want that to look up, and I want that to look up this column here, product ID. And if you hit the square bracket, that's already selected there. So now into the in statement of the uh, M code. So in. So what I want to do is using the table select rows so this all has to be case sensitive otherwise it doesn't work and open brackets so the table that I want to look up is products products there so and then each so we want to iterate through each column and then I'll, I need to define the lay the column name so again it, it automatically shows you that product ID equals and, and the variable almost the the information that we passed here product id okay so need to close the brackets off just need to add in there how to get that data so we've we've told it what i want to look up i want to look at the product id i've told it the table in products and how to link that information so i'm not sure what these are called these type of brackets but there you go so zero within those brackets and I want the product price hit square brackets click OK and there you go so that may save you a bit of time uh, in your power query if you ever need to look up save trying to merge columns uh, it's very simple very straightforward so close and apply there you go and that will be in the data model so uh, quick video thanks for tuning in please hit like please hit subscribe if you're enjoying these videos much more content coming and uh, i'll see you next time